Hi friends, welcome to IIT Starters. In this tutorial, we are going to learn how to interface DS18B20 temperature sensor. Um, this is a waterproof one which I have taken and I have interfaced it with uh, a Raspberry Pi 3 and it's a very simple project. We are going to use Node Red to interface or connect this particular sensor module and display the data in a gauge in Node Red itself. So the node RAID is installed in this particular Raspberry Pi. We have configured it. The temperature which will be measured using this sensor will be displayed in the node RAID. So the connection is very easy. As you know, this is a DS18B20 sensor which works with the one wire connection. So we have enabled one wire in this Raspberry Pi. We have connected a 4.7 kilo ohm resistor over here between the signal pin and the VCC pin and the ground pin is directly connected here you can see the connection in the circuit diagram it's very easy you have to connect only three pins three wires to be connected and this is just a idea you can connect more sensors with the node red configuring it properly and then you can capture the data and display it in dashboard so let's quickly take a look what is required to build this project Now to build this project you need a DS18B20 temperature sensor, a breadboard for prototyping, a 4.7 kilo ohms register, couple of jumper cables and a Raspberry Pi 3 or 4. It will be working with any of the Raspberry Pis that you have got but the more the RAM you get the quicker it will work. So we are connecting using putty uh, to our raspberry pi and here we are entering the password and we have successfully taken the ssh session now we'll start the node red with this command node hyphen red start and it will start the node red in our raspberry pi It may take some time to start, uh, maybe 10 seconds. So it's starting up now. So let's go to one of our browsers from the same computer and type in the IP address of the Pi along with the port number 1880 and that will take us to the node red console the node red console is loading and yes it has loaded completely as you can see the flow we have already created on the left hand side we have all the nodes which are required which are added separately so all these are added now so required nodes are added now so we have the timestamp node then we have the ds18b20 node and this is the function node with temperature in degree celsius this is the debug node and this is the finally dashboard node that we have got so finally using all these things uh, we'll go and open a new browser a new window and then we'll we'll open and type in the same URL but ending with UI and here you can see the temperature is being shown the live temperature data which is captured using the DS18B20 temperature sensor and it is displayed here so if you access the same URL on your mobile phone which is connected to the same network you would be able to see the same gauge showing the data so thank you very much for watching this video um, till the end and hope uh, we'll come up with some new videos very soon. Stay tuned. Uh, please subscribe to this channel if you like the videos. Thank you.